Stride, I think, is the most wonderful thing about him. That's that's why he gets across the ground so so uh, so fast because it's effortless. It's really a long stride, and it's it's his efficiency of motion is efficiency of stride is just incredible. Uh, I haven't seen anything like that for for quite a long time. Uh, Tiz now had a stride like that. John Henry had a stride like that. Um, and those horses come around just very seldom, but I, I truly think he's a great horse, and I believe that sincerely because the the time that he you can't really compare times from one decade to another, from one horse you know that ran many years ago to another. But a good indication of true ability, great ability, is the way he got across the track in the Belmont Stakes. He went the last quarter faster than he went the quarter previous to that. And to me, that's the sign of, of a true champion. Getting fractions right in a race is, is absolutely crucial for every American jockey, much more so probably back uh, than back home. Um, his defeat last time showed what can happen if you get pushed. I think Victor hit the nail on the head. He, he took some blame for his defeat. Uh, he thinks, he said uh, in his interview, he said, I don't think I rode him well. He said, I, th I think I should have just let him run on a little bit. Let him, let him open up on those horses and he probably would have relaxed a little bit better. Uh, I concur. I think that, uh, I think that he restrained him too much and I also think he hit him too much. He hit him 32 times from the middle of the turn. In the Preakness, in the Belmont, he only hit him a couple of times. And they were just taps, just encouragement, coaxing. Okay, it's time to go. Same thing in the Belmont Stakes. I mean, same thing, uh, you know, in, in the Haskell. I mean, he just cantered home in the Haskell without much uh, force at all. So, uh, and then in the Travers, he hit him a bunch again, you know. So I think he's distracting the horse. I think he's not, I, I think the way he rides him that aggressively is not beneficial.